Hello guys and welcome to Let's Play Pokemon Reborn. This is episode 15. As you guys may know, if uh, you were paying attention at all last time, we are having absolutely horrible luck trying to beat this gym leader here. Uh, it, Pokemon are just really, really OP. However, I went and caught a couple of Geodudes and... It definitely appears to have made a difference, because these are her final two Pokémon. So, uh, I, I do believe that we're going to win as soon as Ampharos hits. <sighs> you guys don't know how happy I am about this. Oh, it killed itself. What an absolutely fitting end to this. We defeated Bookworm Shelly. I'm still not good enough, huh? Oh, yes. We can finally progress. And that means that I am recording today. Who'd have thunk it? I mean, you're listening to this. Who'd have thought that I recorded? Yeah, I probably will never live up to his expectations. But, but it's okay. You did really well. Um, Jack received the cocoon badge. Um, since you have that badge now, Pokemon up to level 40 are probably going to like you. It also lets you use the move Rock Smash outside of battle. And, um, oh, here, take this, please. It's Struggle Bug. Oh, I called it. That contains the move Struggle Bug. It's a pretty unique move in that it's both offensive and defensive. It can do damage and lower their special attack. Um, and, yeah, sorry. Just call it my thanks for, um, helping me deal with this. Yeah. No. Uh, I'm Jack. Um, I'm sorry, I forgot to mention earlier. Actually, the Reborn League has a reserve leader for every type. That is, when a gym leader retires, the reserve leader takes their place. Of course, since Heather's dad was, um, you know, that means that the Poison Reserve Leader is now the new gym leader. But they maybe don't know that yet? So I think you should go to the Grand Hall and tell Ame what happened. Actually, it, it's apparently short for Amethyst, the creator of the game. So, uh, Ame? Nah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna stick with Ame. I don't care. Tell her what happened. That way they can get it sorted. Would you do that? Sorry to impose. Um, good luck. Yeah, saving the game. Yes, guys. It only took me, uh, so long. And wow, Geodudes are actually pretty rare in the cave underneath the Grand Stairway. It took forever just to find one. But maybe we'll keep one for now. The level 26. This is this is all the Pokemon that I had left. I had all of my Pokemon left. That's... It's baffling. Uh, anyway, uh, Geodude turned out pretty well. It had uh, Sturdy, so it couldn't be one hit. That was great. And Smackdown, double super effective against uh, Masquerade. And uh, Heather. And Ampharos. Man, Ampharos is such a champ. Really glad we leveled up that Mareep. But anyway, we're gonna heal. Anyway, we should definitely be making our way back to the Grand Hall. I wasn't sure what that place was called, actually. I'm pretty sure we were told at the very beginning of the game, but... Man, that was like four years ago. <laughs> Wait, there's a bunch of people again. Why is there a circle of people? Welcome, come one, come all, to the grand unveiling of Silfco's most fabulous new product. It's the best thing since indoor bread. The most convenient thing since sliced bread. Speaking of Silfco, I wonder if the Link Stone, the thing that's supposed to be able to evolve tradable Pokemon? Since sliced plumbing. Hmm. Lady... What are the chances of that? Are you tired of having to find potentially untrustworthy trainers? Untrustworthy is a single word. Thank you. Trainers to trade your Pokemon with to evolve them? Are you as heartbroken as your Pokemon is when it has to be traded away from you just to grow? Your worries are over. The remarkable scientists of Silfco have produced this marvelous new stone infused with the very energy emitted during a real trade that can force a Pokemon to evolve while never leaving your care. This Link Stone will be hitting stores soon, but you all are a lucky bunch. Right here, right now, you can get a prototype edition, fully functional Link Stone for just 10,000! 
Yeah. Yeah, okay, well then, yeah, I'm not gonna use Fampy then. We'll get a Golem. I was going to say, I was actually just about to say that if the Link Stone isn't in yet, we'll continue using Fampy. But if it is, then I wouldn't mind a Golem. And, uh, it is, and I just spent all of my money on it. Yeah, $141. Wait. Right. She's the third gem now, because, yeah. Let's see. Where's she at? Is she always up here? Okay, she's right there. Well, look, if it isn't Jack, looking like a lost puppy as usual. I was just telling Ame here about your little accident with the barrel gym leader. It's really unfortunate. I was worried about him for this exact reason. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Look, tell Aya to be ready by the time I get there, okay? Yeah, I'll call her now. Oh, and hi, Jack. Bye, Jack. You look confused. Well, more confused than normal. See, every gym in the Reborn League needs a backup, right? Like I'm the backup for the Flowbot. When she retires, I take over. Well, same thing for th is true for the Poison Guy. He retired, well, in a sense, you know. So now we're letting the backup, Aya, know she's up. Turns out she's some chick who lives in the wasteland south of the city. Heh, <laughs> but she won't be able to get out that way unless you have the key. And guess what? I do! I've already got three badges and it's about to be four. Man, that Shelly girl was a pushover. I hate you. I hope you fall and break your legs. It was like she wasn't even trying. I mean, she seemed like she was going to keel over and cry at any second. But hey, I'll take the badge. Anyway, I'm off. Good luck. Finding the key... Oh, good... <sighs> Whoops. Of course, he wouldn't say good luck. Good luck finding the key to the wasteland. What? You want to know where I got it? Why would I tell? You know what? No, fine. Fight me, Jack. If you win, I'll tell you. But, like, that's gonna happen. Come on! No! I need warning! I need... You're ugly. You got ugly little hippie glasses. Look at you. I don't... I don't think I'm gonna be able to do this, guys. Maybe I will. I'm double super effective with Pyroar. Hmm. I wish I could skip all of the uh, stat changes because I really do or have them all in one message box because it's really annoying. Ludicolo. Uh, actually, we're gonna try and use Noibat for that. Noibat doesn't evolve until level 48, so we might as well get there, right? Look how much damage he took! Almost... What? That's a third of his health? Just about? Wow, and okay, he does no damage. Man. Noibat is a very garbage Pokemon. I would really love to keep him, but I'm really not sure that's gonna happen. That was a critical. Doesn't count. But really? Ampharos is a pretty good Pokemon. I think, anyway. Uh, she turned out pretty great. Super, super potions are cheating. I ain't using no potions. Now I'm gonna use a potion, though. I only used, uh, like, three potions on that battle as well. It was great. No! Get poison, or not poison, the other thing. What's it called? Paralyzed. Affect it! Water gun should be not very... I, I still maintain that water moves should hurt the Pokemon who uses them if they attack an electric Pokemon. Because that's just stupid. Come on now. My Pokemon generates... Okay, really? Generates electricity out of its body. And yet, it doesn't affect you? Come on now. That's just ridiculous. Yeah. Finally, Paralysis doing something. Who's up next? Roserade. Well, looks like it's time for Pyro again. Hmm. Really? Sleep powder? Come on now, be reasonable. Wake up. No! Yeah, wow, okay. Wait, what? How did he wake up? I don't understand. Why are you faster than me? Pyro is always faster. It's cheap. Using hacks. 
Wow, 3,500 EXP? Servine. Well, we're gonna stick right here, I guess. You're really starting to grate on my nerves, and you don't want to do that. Or what? What are you gonna do? Throw your little ugly snake at me? Actually, Superior is a really cool Pokemon. But I feel like it shouldn't be singularly typed. At least, I think it should either be dragon type or poison type, because it's a snake. I mean, really. Oh no. Let me just run from this battle. Come on now. Be reasonable. That's just a useless move to have. Wow, level 37. Already nearing the level cap with Pyro again. Noob. So is the one who lost. Talk about cheap. Whatever, man. You want to know about the key? Fine. I don't care. So the new poison gym leader is a girl who lives out in the wasteland, yeah? Well, I got the key from her brother. He's a real fruity looking guy. Decked out in purple, fishnets, looks more like a girl. Totally freaky. He wouldn't stop singing either. What, you know him? Ha! I should have expected. You would. So yeah, he said he was going to the Barrel Cemetery for something or other. If you want a key, go ask him. Later, loser. I don't want to talk to him. Come on now, that guy definitely wants me. I mean, I understand. I mean, look at this body. Can you guys resist? I, I don't think so. It must be very hard for you guys to sit there and watch. I can't remember the guy's name, though. Wait, which way is to the barrel ward? This way. Wait, which... This game is very stupid in that the map is absolutely useless. Okay, so that's... Where is the barrel ward at? Lapis. Jasper. Barrel ward. Okay. Okay, okay. So we have to go to the Jasper ward. Okay. But really, it, this game has a really crappy map. The, the creator probably wanted to do something special and make it look different, but... That was a horrible idea. Anyway, I'll meet you guys there. Okay, guys, here we are at the Barrel Ward. Still can't remember that guy's name. The only name that pops into my head is Fern, and his name is not Fern. So let's see, do I have to... No, I don't have to redo the puzzle. Wait, actually... There's... Oh, there's an item. Silver Ring. What's that do? Silver Ring. A plain silver band that probably belonged to Cory. So it's useless. Link stone. Oh, that's gonna be so cool. Hmm. I didn't know that there were purple shards. I thought there was just red, blue, and green. Red, yellow, and green. Colors. I don't. How do colors work? Help. I don't know which colors there were. Is, is she already here? No, okay, so I have to go talk to her brother first. But if Fern's going out to the wasteland already... Hmm. Oh man, I have Rock Smash now. There's so much I can do. We're gonna go... You know what, we're gonna... Hmm. Actually, hmm. We should probably go back to that cave. The, uh... Oh man, what's it called? Cave underneath the Grand Stairway? There's there's a bunch of rock break rocks there. Oh man. Yeah, we're gonna take a break from this. I'll meet you back at that cave. Okay guys, we're here in the spooky scary cave. I taught rock smash to Geodude. So let's go. Yeah, beat that rock. Rock. Let's see what I don't Okay, those rocks are obviously special, right? Somehow. Okay, well that wasn't as spectacular as I... Really? The rock reappears? When you rock smash something, it should be permanently gone. This game is ridiculous. Oh, yeah, okay. You guys, I spent half an hour here just to catch those two Geodude. And then of course there's a Geodude. Speaking of Geodudes, let's Geo repel. Repel. Cool, okay. I'm not sure why this rock is here. Unless I can go over... Yeah, what's the point of that rock? Okay, let's find more 
hidden things. Anything hidden over here? Yeah. Ooh, that's special. We're gonna save it. You never know. There's gotta be an item here. No? Really? Okay. Yum! Yum ta! Haha, check out that treasure! The rocks down here are full of rare items. All you need is a pickaxe and a hammer to try to try and pry them out. Just be careful, if you're too reckless, the rock will collapse in on itself and you won't get anything. Here, give it a try. Mining kit. Smack the wall with the hammer, chip away with the pickaxe, and press space to switch between the two. Good luck now. I want to mine the Okay, so it's just basic mining. Like this. Oh, heart scale. Man. I actually have a lot of fun mining in Pokemon. I spent a lot of time doing this in Diamond when I had it. Okay, so a green shard, blue shard, and a heart scale. That's not too bad. If I can even reveal the blue one. I'm not sure if I can. Yeah, I think I got that. Wow, the blue shard is just a plate? A whole plate? Really? Green shard... Splash plate! It's not a shard. Interesting. Okay. Huh. Might as well mine all the glowy rocks, right? So I guess in this game, you can't just mine into any wall. You have to mine the glowy rocks. Okay, see, this one's not a whole plate. That's interesting, though. That you can mine the plates down here? I mean, I don't have a water Pokemon to use that plate, but if I did, that'd be really useful. So the blue shards are shards of a plate, though. Oh, hey, what's this? Another door? Huh. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Oh man, what is this? It's the, uh, something rock. Eat rock? Sounds right, I think. I don't know, warm rock maybe? Purple shard. I really don't remember purple shards existing. In... they weren't in Zeta, were they? And I don't remember them being in, like, fire red or... Diamond and Pearl, either. But Diamond and Pearl had those stupid, uh, spheres. Huh. Where the- where's the other item? This sucks. Oh. Wait, there are four items? You gotta be kidding. How am I supposed to find it? <gasps> I found it. That's a revive. Oh, yes, I finally have a single revive. That's so cool, though. Good, 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 good. Revives are beyond super stupid rare in this game. Yeah, I can't just mine into the wall. But that's very interesting. Ah, I really shouldn't have to re-rock break everything. There's got to be more stuff hidden in this cave. Let's continue on. Why? I feel like some rocks are just there for no reason. Okay, there's nothing over there. Let's try all the way to the left here. Ooh, almost failed that. Okay, there's a ladder. And... Man, repels wear off so fast. That's it. Okay. Hmm. I remember the square things were important, well, relatively in Zeta. They were the secret base things, right? In the second region? 
but I'm very curious as to what their purpose is in this game. Hmm. I feel like I'm just wasting repels. Which way am I supposed to go? This way, perhaps? Maybe I can jump down. I don't think so, though. This is just for this. Let's mine another rock, shall we? Two. Always go for the easiest spots first, just to see if there's something there. I have found nothing. Okay, there's an egg here. I believe this is the egg used to... It's either... Wait, is it Lucky Egg? Or is that the egg to evolve Happiny? If that's Lucky Egg, that'd be great! Oh wow, another? Uh, no, this one's a slightly different shade of blue, isn't it? Isn't it? Okay, let's see. Oval Stone. Dread Plate. What type is Dread Plate? I want to say dark, but that wasn't black. It is dark, though. <laughs> Heat Rock. Uh, sunny Day. Oval Stone. Yeah, it's the Happiny Rock. That is so useless. I'm going to look for more stuff in this cave. We'll be right back. I found a Lunatome. Doesn't it look all special? Okay, I wasn't sure if I was going to have to battle it. What level? 25. It's a shame. See, I could have used this Lunatome when I was fighting that gym back there. I realized that Noibat is a very crappy Pokemon for this. He did like 2 damage. Cosmic Power, Defense Rose, and Special Defense. That's great. That means I'm going to do less damage. Oh, right! Bite's super effective! Hmm. We're gonna catch this Lunatone, though. That shouldn't kill it. Yeah. Cool. Now we're in red, and a Pokeball probably will not catch it. But we're gonna try anyway. We really need Great Balls and Ultra Balls! But the creator of this game was like, nah, screw you. You don't deserve anything. Go cry in a corner. Just one hit, noy bad. That's terrible. Yeah, let's go... Will it in, I guess. It doesn't really matter. We're just trying to catch it. I mean, I'm not sure we'll ever use it, because... I mean, Golem. I spent 10,000 Poka on that... Stupid Link Stone. I, I'm not sure if it would have been cheaper in the store. It probably would have been. It becomes very active on the night of a full moon. This Pokemon was first discovered 40 years ago at the site of a meteor strike. No nickname. Never a nickname. Onward. Okay, so we gotta find where this guy is. He's apparently in the barrel ward somewhere. Maybe he's up here because we needed Rock Smash before. I hate wild Pokemon. They love to interrupt sentences. You suck, Ekka. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah. Backwards snake. See, that's easy to say. Let's go. I wonder if Pokemon pop out of breakable rocks in this game. I know they do in some of the games. But that's just so annoying. Okay. Now we are in... It is pitch black in here. Let's bumble around a little bit. Just gotta stick close to the walls, that's all. Right? This is how you do it, right? Oh no, it goes down over here. I'm gonna get lost. This is a... Oh. No, 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 no. We shouldn't do this. We shouldn't do that. That's a, that's a stupid choice. Okay, I guess we gotta find Flash somewhere. That's gonna suck that we have to teach that to a Pokemon. What a waste of a move slot. Okay, so that is not where we're going. Hmm. Maybe he's in one of the houses or something, I guess. Or in the graveyard? Wait, no! Duh! We were literally told that he's in the graveyard. He's right there. Okay, let me see if I can remember his name. Hmm. Kane. Figured it out. Yep. Hey, Jack! Didn't expect to see you here. I actually came up here because I heard what happened with the old poison leader. 
I mean, I know there's nothing anyone can do for him, but I heard he left behind a daughter, too? Rather, she ran away. I wanted to find her, because I know that's a big thing, not having anyone to take care of you when you're so young. So how about you, Jack? What brings you here? You know, you don't have to stalk me. You could just ask me out like a normal person. Hey, chill out. I'm just joking. Oh, you want the key to the wasteland to battle my sister, too? Yeah. I should have thought as much. <laughs> I'm not totally a fan of her, though. She's all... Grrr. But eh, whatevs. Eh, okay, I'll tell you what. Beat me, and I'll give you the key. Okay, okay? Why? Just give me the key. You love me. You definitely look like a girl. His face just looked like a girl. Okay. Ooh, level 32. Hmm. I'm not sure Noibat is going to be good for this, because Noibat is garbage. It wasn't even a critical hit. That wasn't even a critical hit. Not even a critical. And it was not very effective. Noibat is like the definition of useless garbage. Maybe we'll drop Noibat. Maybe. You know what? Maybe I'll go play games in the arcade until I get 10,000 coins and get a trap inch. I mean, I'm not going to do it, but maybe. That's a lot of coins. Come on. I just want a trap inch. Flygon is like the coolest Pokemon in the game. It is number one, my favorite Pokemon. I'm not sure what move it used on me that was super effective. I, I wasn't paying attention. Okay, Venomoth is flying, right? Venomoth is not flying. It's bug and poison. I just made a terrible mistake. Uh, Smackdown, anyway. Okay, Geodude's kind of crappy, too. Oh, it was flying. Or No, it's bug. Never mind. I forgot that bug is super effective. Or, I, You know what I mean. You know what I mean. Ha! Ah, beat a Pyroar. I like how the female Pyroar looks. I like that it's got the thing on its back, or, you know, the thing going down its back rather than a big mane. The mane just makes the male Pyroars look like they got fat necks. Well, I guess they probably do have fat necks. Lions have fat necks, right? Yeah, it's the same size as their head. That That's what a fat neck is. Like, in real life, if someone's neck is the same size as their head, they just look ridiculous. But why doesn't that affect lions, huh? Huh? Why can't we make fun of lions for having fat necks? Why are they immune? Stop animal abuse. God. Wait. No. Stop human abuse? One of those. I wasn't paying attention. I, I need to stop talking. Anyway, we're just gonna toss out Amphrost, because that's a bad idea. We, we literally can't deal damage to him. There. Confused rate. That's that's all we can do. <sighs> He's half ground type, so... However, me however, Meowstic... Oh, and I found a mind plate, so Meowstic gets extra power. I wonder how much power they get from the plates. Is it actually a useful amount of power, or... Hmm. Anyway, Meowstic definitely needs leveled up. Yeah. Oh, come on. I even have a plate with Drew. Okay, well, that's no better at all. Come on. Be reasonable. Okay, so level 33 Meowstic. Yeah. Nope. I forgot that he was a poison trainer, but he has Oshawott. Or was that Deepwat? Or was that Oshawott still? I don't remember already, and that happened like. 45 seconds ago. Okay, so Kane, Kane was easy to beat. So now we get a key. How great, right? Right. Wow, and almost another level up. That's pretty great. Ah, oh well. Well, darn. Oh well. I don't really like giving it out, but... Huh? You're... What are you looking at? Oh. Heather, right? Why do you know me? I'm sorry, my name's Kane. I was looking for you, uh, just because I was worried. What, so you can place a bunch of stupid rules on me too? Don't bother, I'm fine. I can be just fine by myself. Hey, no, no, no. I just wanted to be friends. See, I... Just shut up! I didn't ask for anything from you. I don't need anything. I think you need a friend. You're so annoying. I already have a friend. Oh, who would that be? She's a gym leader, okay? And she doesn't ask so many stupid questions. 
Hey, hey, sorry, okay? Well, your friend is probably worried, so you should maybe go to her. Fine, if it'll get me away from you, weirdo, I will. Salamence, let's go, it's takeoff time. Why does a little girl have a Salamence? Give me that key. Hmm, she's flying off towards the Lapis Ward. She's on the road, far from home, and she doesn't. but she doesn't have to feel alone. Nah, I'm just worried about her. I'm gonna go down to the Lapis Ward. The gym leader there is Shelly, right? Ah, about the key. Sorry, I have to hurry off before she flies somewhere else. Maybe later. You're gonna be kidding me! Come on! <sighs> Come on, I came all this way. Why do you gotta be like that, Kane? <sighs> so rude. But, that will have to wait. Because this is the end of the episode. That's all the time we have for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.